Hey everybody, welcome back to Sultan Sanctuary. So now we can upgrade our transmuter gear. So, okay, we only transmute our weapons. Alright then, so we'll transmute the Morningstar 3 to the Harmon Mace 2. And granted, it only has B scaling, but eh. And I'll put it back to a Morning Star 1, but. Make your weapons sing. So it's a little bit heavier, but we still don't. We're still rolling. Alright, so I actually did gain a couple level ups while I was farming for shit. But we need one more. Hmm. It actually seems to attack a little bit faster on its own. Oh, hey, we're, <laughs> we're one-shotting those things now. Nice. Also went and got a couple more of the uh, poison. The poison cyto cells. So we should be able to go turn those into the dude up here. Ah, so it's the same one of these for... Hmm, so we can make it so I guess we always get at least one page of light every time. What did these do again? Oh yeah, this was health fatigue and poisoning. Because I don't know if getting another Water Blessing will increase the number of Water Blessings we actually have, because of, I don't know if that'll work, but I know we can, should be able to get more Orange Files. Drown Berserkers. That actually raise our Oh yeah, we're devotion rank three. Is there a back way out of here? Yes there is. Hmm. Link of fire and sky. Yeah, hold on, respawn. There we are. Yeah, <clears throat> since I switched over to my, had to switch over to my backup machine, the aspect ratios and stuff are a little bit different. It makes it a little more difficult to, uh, to see things clearly, so I'm kind of actually... <laughs> Ow. Actually wearing my glasses again for a change. I don't see a fucker. Oh, 
Okay then. That happened. Oh yeah, probably should check out see what that ring does. Nullifies elemental imbalance. Mm -hmm. I have no idea what that does. More forest fangs. Oh, the green key opened that. But what's up here? A stone leader. The False Jester. Okay. Okay. All right, that just this just lets me restock my stuff. Greetings, friend. You've come to chatter? From where I sit, you seem the matter. A fork, spoon, knife, and a drowned man's wife. Where I come from, in is out, up, down is up, up is down. Plate, cup, bowl, a broken widow sold. Would you like this rich perspective? Trust me, Lord, it's quite authentic. Elbow, jaw, knee, and a grave beneath the sea. Sure. Fear not, then. Extend your hand. There is a great power in a brand. White, searing hot, and iron forged thought. Seek and find the hollowed stones. What comes next, I trust you'll know. Fate, faith, fade, and the calm beneath the shade. Hmm. So now we can use these to walk on ceilings. And if we walk past one of those things, it turns off the function. 
silver leaf. Silver shield. Okay. So the silver shield. An embossed heater shield forged primarily of silver, precious metal widely believed to ward away evil. Plus silver provides substantial protection from supernatural attacks, but its exceptionally high conductivity leads the wielder desperately vulnerable to electricity. Hmm. This, because now we can to progress. Yeah, to progress we can enter the uh, the castle now. But there's other places. Stone Alchemist. Oh, that was a... Uh... I can see down there. So.
that one, uh, that was that elevator couple videos ago. That we found. Those things don't actually restore all that much. Hmm. Oh well, I mean, it's a renewable healing item, so... Can't really bash it too hard. So the green key unlocked this. Oh! Okay, so if you went down... Okay, if you went down and fought the, the, the Kraken Cyclops and got the green key, then you could bypass, you could bypass the boss fight with the, fault, with the uh, False Jester. That was dumb. Luckily it didn't kill me. Okay, let's go back to some place where we can actually level up. No, I won't use the, the blacksmith. Uh, let's... Do I have one in Bandit's Pass? No, that's a cleric. There's a village of smiles that I have blacksmith. Can we... upgrade... Yes, yes we can. So let's get a Harmon Mace 3. Oh, wait, you can buy locks of hair from him? Salt Seeker's Ring. Reveals the location of its owner's missing lost salt. Lantern Charm. Illuminates surroundings. Hmm. buy some of these.
Now let's actually level up some. We got six points. So let's get plus four hammers, more stamina, and more even more strength. And then if we save up five points, we can get five more points of strength, and it looks like class five is the final grade. So yeah. Let's go that route. That sounds like a good idea. And with this big ol' fat buff in, in strength... Uh... Let's pop that, um... Use that for a whoop stick. And did I go up here? The other... Path? I still need... Get off me. Sack assault and a different kind of shield. Large wooden shield. Light enough to be held in one hand, yet sturdy enough to repel blades and the like. Hmm. That'll make me fat roll. Wait a second. Ah, shit. Voracious Charm. Leech's HP. Well... You know, ba -da 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 -da. Fail! Unless we don't necessarily need the Lantern Charm until we actually get into, like, a dark, dirty area. Hey, what else was it? You wanted Berserker Ears, wasn't it? I don't know about Angsty Bones? I don't know about... Th I think I know where there might be an Armor Might. But... As for these ones, I think the Berserkers are the guys who, like, throw axes willy-nilly near, uh... I think I know, I think I know which one the Berserkers are. Maybe. God damn it. Get back here. Let me 
And I think that's all for up that way. So now we just gotta go down. That's a floating eyeball with a... Whoa. Heart seeker nerves. Blessed weapon. Can't cast it, but... Yeah, that yeah, makes him invulnerable. So what's this shit? Hello. Doom. Stone Mage and five shards. Do not jump, pit. Jump down to sanctuary below. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with the I'm probably going to die. So we got a stone mage. But we don't have any skill points in mage class, so. Wait a second. That's a different person, and the uh, first person's gone. Ooh, hey, we got enough for a level up, though. Bank that, and, oops. Um. We'll go to the, back to the Shivering Shore for now. I put a blacksmith here? Here? Huh. One quick... Oh, no, it's... What was it down in here? I thought there might have been another thing in the woods. Hmm... Actually, it's close enough to the end. Yeah, it's 30 minutes, so I'll we'll explore more next time. See ya.